Hey guys, welcome back to NCIX. Uh, we just filmed Netlinked here in the MSI suite, and now we're here with Mark, and he's going to tell us a little more about uh, what MSI has coming up for uh, motherboards. So uh, what do we got here? We got a micro ATX and a full size? Yes. Um, since last year, 2013, our gaming series has been very successful with Intel. So this year, in 2014 at CES, we are probably to announce that uh, we are implementing the gaming series into our AMD series on the AMD's chipset. So this is the new um, A88X for the Carvari um, chipset for the micro and the standard size uh, motherboard. Awesome. Yeah. Audio boost, killer NIC card, all the features that's available like command center and, and other softwares that's included. Awesome. So now the AMD AMD users get some love that yes, the Intel guys overclockable, definitely. So you oh, can right play now? around with overclock or you can use the O C genie for easy overclocking. Sweet. Yeah. And that comes with the mother in yes, in comes. the BIOS. Yes, it does. It comes with the BIOS and it features in there. Right on. Okay, so let's move on. There's some cool uh, motherboards over here as well. Okay, now we're over here on the Intel side with one of the few Haswell uh, Mini ITX gaming boards, and it's super full featured. Uh, why don't you tell us a little bit about that? Hi. Um, okay, we have featuring the new uh, Z87i gaming um, motherboard, audio boost, um, the killer NIC card, and also wireless 802.11 AC. And so that's something that we're, we're not seeing on a lot of uh, gaming motherboards, but it's, it's awesome to see that implemented here. Yeah, that's definitely, you don't see that much usually on a, a mini ITX board like this. So it's, um, it's pretty groundbreaking for us to introduce like all these features into such a small form factor. And especially uh, we're preparing for the Steam OS. Uh, we want people to see that, you know, MSI will be doing something with the Steam OS and right. definitely will push to that market uh, small form factor. Steam OS, Steam OS, keywords. <laughs> all right, so we just looked at a mini ITX gaming board and now we're gonna look at the first mini ITX GTX 760. Is that, is that right? That, that's what this guy is. Yes, uh, this is the first ever GTX 760 ITX board. Um, it retains the speed of the 760 reference card. Um, so it's very, as you can see, it's very compact and it has a pin. So, and it has a specially unique fan called yeah. a Radex fan, where uh, the air flows when you uh, when it's turned on and using it, it'll blow in different direction. Right, so the fins are, are yes. kind of configured rating out, out from, the, from the center there instead of horizontal or vertical, so. Correct, and also this card is overclockable, so you can uh, go to a gaming app or even use a software like the Afterburner to overclock it, yes. Right on, mm -hmm. it is many but mighty. <laughs> And now this guy is massive. It's the R9-290X Lightning. Um, it is triple high on the radiator, but then only keeps, takes up two PCIe uh, slots in the back. Uh, why don't you tell us a little bit about this? I mean, it is enormous. Hi, okay, so this is uh, our new R9-290 Lightning. Um, it hasn't been released yet, but um, what is unique about it is that um, this card, we actually removed some of the heat pipes, but we expanded the fins for the heat sink in order to do a better cooling um, airflow. And also, each fan has its own controller um, in the software that we will provide, and also requires the two eight pins. But the six pin is optional for you to do more extreme overclocking. And also, there's a dual BIOS switch. One is for normal, and the other one's for LN2. For those that who wants to do like you know liquid nitrogen um, overclocking. So you can literally just like yeah pump as much uh, performance into this thing as possible. Exactly. Yeah. So there is no cap speed. And uh, sorry about that. AMD did not put a cap on this so you can definitely do overclocking to whatever you want but you know just make sure that you are you know, have efficient cooling on this Whoa. Yeah. so if you're looking for uh just the craziest performance ever you should yeah. try to look at so when is this uh do we know when it's coming out or probably sometime in february latest it would be march but you know it'll be soon definitely uh Okay, February, March. All right, yeah. Awesome. All right, that's it for the MSI suite, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for showing us around, Mark. No problem. Thank A you. And uh, yeah, we're now we're off to look at some other cool stuff at CES. Stay tuned for more coverage, and don't forget to subscribe for to NCIX Tech Tips for more of this awesomeness.